when we first went to see Robin, he did not look at me. He would pay no attention to me, and then 50 minutes later, just sort of look at me with a laser eye and say, do you think you're sexy? And a couple more questions came at me. And then at the end, he said, rather terrifying, learn Richard III, the first monologue. And that was it. Can you imagine? You know, teach this guy some Shakespeare. <laughs> Good for him. And all the clouds that lowered upon our... And all the clouds that lowered... Ah, better, better. He could figure out what it was an actor could do well, and he would get that actor to do that, no matter what it was. I always believe that you should both be looking at the same problem. So if you stand next to the actor and you're both looking towards the problem and discussing it, then you don't feel as though you're adversaries. Not only a master of teaching, but in rehearsal, we keep going, why aren't you playing all the parts anyway? <laughs> that was with the first Doctor Who. <laughs> How skinny your arms are. <laughs> he expected you to be good. <laughs> he expected you to be everything.